Welcome back, Psy Sippers. Today, we're tackling a phenomenon so mind-blowing, it'll have you questioning everything you thought you knew about liquids. Have you ever wondered why a droplet of water skates on a hot pan instead of instantly evaporating? Prepare for your minds to be blown. We'll uncover the secrets of this mind-bending phenomenon, how it works, and why it's more than just a cool kitchen trick. Let's journey back to 1756 when Johann Gottlob Leidenfrost first noted this curious occurrence. It challenges our intuition, doesn't it? The Leidenfrost effect, as we now call it, arises when a liquid encounters a surface far exceeding its boiling point, forming a protective vapor layer that keeps the liquid from immediate evaporation. It is a fascinating display of the interplay between heat, surface physics, and fluid dynamics. To understand the Leidenfrost effect, one must delve into the realms of thermodynamics and fluid mechanics. Let's start with the basics. It all comes down to the interaction between a hot surface and a liquid droplet. When the surface is heated to a temperature significantly above the liquid's boiling point, a fascinating phenomenon occurs. The bottom layer of the liquid droplet vaporizes almost instantaneously upon contact with the heated surface. This rapid vaporization creates a protective layer of vapor that insulates the rest of the droplet from the intense heat. Now, this vapor layer isn't just a simple protective shield, it's a dynamic, constantly changing entity. The heat from the surface maintains its existence, continuously vaporizing the liquid droplet to replenish the vapor that escapes into the atmosphere. This continuous cycle of vaporization and escape forms the basis of the Leidenfrost effect. But what about the droplet itself? Why doesn't it just flatten and spread out under gravity? The answer lies in the realm of fluid mechanics. The surface tension of the liquid droplet tries to minimize the surface area, leading to the formation of a near spherical shape. This surface tension, combined with the upward force exerted by the vapor layer, allows the droplet to float above the hot surface, defying gravity. Now, onto the Leidenfrost point. This is the critical temperature at which the Leidenfrost effect kicks in. It's not a fixed value, but rather depends on the properties of the liquid and the nature of the surface. For water on a smooth, flat surface, the Leidenfrost point is typically around 200 degrees Celsius. But for other liquids or surfaces, it could be significantly different. So it is the high heat, the rapid vaporization, and the surface tension that conspire to create this captivating spectacle. The Leidenfrost effect is a testament to the intricate dance of forces and phenomena in our universe. It's a reminder that even in the seemingly mundane, there exists a world of wonder and fascination, waiting to be discovered and understood. The Leidenfrost effect is not just a piece of scientific trivia. It has practical implications and intriguing applications. So let's delve into the fascinating world of applied science where the Leidenfrost effect holds a significant role. It's far more than a mere spectacle of physics. It's a phenomenon with pragmatic implications, particularly in the realm of heat transfer prevention. Consider nuclear safety. The Leidenfrost effect can play a crucial part in preventing overheating in nuclear reactors. When a coolant, typically water, comes into contact with a reactor's superheated surfaces, the Leidenfrost effect can create an insulating vapor layer. This layer can help manage the reactor's temperature, adding an extra level of safety. Then let's shift gears and think about engines. Cooling systems are vital for preventing engine overheating, and the Leidenfrost effect could offer a novel approach. By exploiting this effect, engineers might be able to design more efficient cooling systems that use less coolant while providing better heat management. Yet, the implications of the Leidenfrost effect aren't confined to heavy industry. It also finds a place in the culinary arts. Chefs have long observed that a droplet of water dances on a hot griddle, a direct result of the Leidenfrost effect. This phenomenon can help in maintaining the right temperature for cooking, ensuring that food doesn't stick to the pan, and even creating a unique flavor profile in seared dishes. Finally, understanding the Leidenfrost effect could lead to the development of heat-resistant materials. By studying how the vapor layer works and how it might be harnessed, scientists and engineers could design materials that resist heat damage, extending their lifespan and enhancing their performance. 
The light and frost effect, therefore, extends beyond the spectacle and into the realm of practical, impactful science. It's more than a curious quirk of physics. It's a testament to the power of scientific understanding and a reminder of how even the seemingly small and strange can have profound implications in our world. Despite our understanding, the light and frost effect still harbors mysteries that science is yet to unravel. Unresolved questions linger, like specters in the mist, challenging our comprehension of this elusive phenomenon. For instance, the precise dynamics of the vapor layer that forms under the droplet still eludes us. How does it shape and reshape itself, and what are the minute interactions that dictate its behavior? We know it's there, we see its effects, yet its intimate details remain hidden. Moreover, the factors affecting the Leiden frost point the exact temperature at which the effect occurs, continue to perplex. While we understand its influence by the nature of the liquid, the surface material, and the ambient conditions, the intricate interplay among these variables is still a complex puzzle waiting to be solved. These questions are not mere academic curiosities. They are the frontier of our understanding, the gateways to potential breakthroughs. Scientists around the globe are relentlessly probing these mysteries, using advanced tools and techniques. From high-speed cameras capturing the dance of droplets to computational models simulating the vapor layer dynamics, the quest for answers is more intense than ever. Every discovery, every insight, brings us closer to harnessing the full potential of the Leiden-Frost effect. From enhancing heat transfer systems to designing futuristic transportation technologies, the Leidenfrost effect, thus, continues to challenge and inspire scientists towards greater discoveries. Here are a couple of related effects involving fluid and thermodynamics that share similarities with the Leidenfrost effect. Film boiling. Like the Leidenfrost effect, film boiling involves a layer of vapor separating a liquid from a hot surface. However, in film boiling, this vapor layer is much thinner and more unstable, leading to faster boiling and less insulation. Film boiling is relevant in various industrial processes where heat transfer is crucial, such as boiling water in power plants or cooking food in fryers. Cavitation Both the Leidenfrost effect and cavitation involve the formation and collapse of bubbles in a liquid. However, the driving force and consequences differ. In the Leidenfrost effect, rapid vaporization creates bubbles, while in cavitation, pressure changes in a flowing liquid cause them. When these bubbles collapse near a solid surface, they can create intense localized pressure and damage. Understanding cavitation is crucial in preventing damage to pumps, propellers and other submerged structures. Marangoni Convection In the Leidenfrost effect, the hot surface creates a temperature gradient that influences the vapor layer. In Marangoni Convection, surface tension variations from temperature differences drive fluid flow within the liquid. Marangoni convection plays a role in various phenomena, including paint drying and crystal growth. In the grand pantheon of scientific phenomena, the Leidenfrost effect holds a unique and mesmerizing place. It stands as a testament to the interplay of heat and liquid, a ballet of physics that dances on the threshold of our understanding, a reminder of the oddity and wonder that the natural world holds in every droplet. This phenomenon, where a liquid in near contact with a mass significantly hotter than the liquid's boiling point produces an insulating vapor layer that keeps the liquid from boiling rapidly is more than just a spectacle. It carries practical implications, potential applications in engineering, technology and beyond, beckoning us to harness its power. Yet, the Leidenfrost effect is far from being completely understood. Its complexity presents unresolved questions, challenges for future research, and the promise of scientific breakthroughs. The Leidenfrost effect, a dance of heat and liquid, a testament to nature's intricate design, continues to captivate us with its mystique and promise of scientific breakthroughs. Did this video make you want to dance like a water droplet on a hot pan? If so, give it a thumbs up. And to join the Sci Sipping community for more mind-blowing science, hit that subscribe button. What other mind-bending science questions do you have? Let us know in the comments below.